You know, when David Fisdale was fired and Mike Miller was hired as the interim head coach, I thought there was a potential that maybe Mike Miller could be the guy. See, I did research on Mike Miller, former head coach, I believe, of the Westminster, Westchester, West, West Newberry, West Nantucket, Knicks in the G League. We need a guy who's different from who we usually hire. We don't need a big bravado head coach who has a big personality, who is a who has a large character. We needed a guy who was a pencil neck geek who had flannel shirts in his closet. He was going to button up, get his pen and talk about what he can do, what plays he can draw up. He an egoless head coach that was able to hold people accountable. That's what we needed. And Mike Miller was that guy. I actually wanted Mike Miller to stay as head coach. But when Tom Thibodeau got hired, I was going to support this team. Because Leon Rose, like I always say, has a plan. But I just wanted to make this simple video to tell you that I appreciate Mike Miller. Because what Mike Miller showed me is that he steadied the ship. And even though he didn't get a longer stay as much as he wanted to, I will always remember his professionalism. But I'm all in on Tom Thibodeau. And you can't tell me anything less. And that's why next year when we win the NBA championship, we have to give some credit to Mike Miller. And if there was anybody else as the head coach, I would have a problem. I would have a problem with letting go of Mike. But Tom is the guy. Defensive-minded, hard-nosed, holds people accountable. And we don't even have to give him that much attention. We don't have to give him that many roles. See, the Minnesota Timberwolves, not only are they corrupt, because they had to go out there and give up money so they can steal the number one pick from the New York Knicks. But they gave Tom Thibodeau too much power. They made him drunk. They made him a glutton for power. The Knicks are not going to do that. Leon Rose is going to put him in his place. And he's going to do what he usually does best. He's going to coach these guys. Because Tom Thibodeau was a catalyst for the 2008 Boston Celtics team. And he's going to be the catalyst for the 2021 New York Knicks championship team. You feel it? Do you sense it? Do you smell it? So I got a question for all you New York Knickerbocker fans. Are you ready to make history? Are you ready to break barriers? Are you ready to see RJ be a future Hall of Famer? So put on your Knicks gear. And get ready, because the draft is coming soon. And Leon Rose, Lord knows what Leon Rose is going to do. Leon Rose might damn near snag LaMelo Ball. Leon Rose might damn well get the best player in the draft. And it may not even be LaMelo. It may not even be James Wiseman. It may not even be Anthony Edwards. He might snag the best player. It might be Tyrese Hale Burton. All I know is I'm excited. It's... It's, shh, 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 you smell it? You smell it? It's draft season. And it's, it's fresh and that aroma, it smells like a freshly baked pecan pie. And I can't wait to see the New York Knickerbocker of the generation, the next Nick, suit up and boot up. For a championship run. You better love it. You better like it. Because the orange and blue will always. Always. Reign supreme. Over you.